Hey everybody, Sniper the Lazy Man here. Welcome back to Shadows of the Damned. So, last episode, uh, really nothing in there. Last episode, we faced it off against uh, Justine in the last uh, 2D side scrolling level. And now we've been running around in these uh, creepy catacomb area. So, let's uh, go on ahead and continue. And hi, Paula again. Yes, yes, she has. Um, so. Once again, we don't know one of these running sections. Got to get through as best as, as we can, which can be kind of uh, tricky sometimes. Oh, no. Wow, okay. <laughs> I didn't think I could have actually gotten through that. <laughs> All right. Yes, I would very much like to restart. Um... So it's been almost like about like two weeks since I've last played this game. <laughs> that just kind of shows you how much I've been either busy and have spread these episodes out. Uh, I didn't think I was actually going to be able to get through that, so I'm just trying to... Nope, that was a bad idea. Uh, X, that's it. Okay. That should probably would be better. Okay. Yeah, I just wasted an absinthe for nothing. Duh. Well, it, it's kind of... I don't know. It's kind of more the, uh... It's kind of less my fault. And more the fact that the game puts absinthe as default. As the next, uh, alcohol. They probably did that as sort of like a joke that's like, Oh, if you didn't want to actually use that much, then, uh... Too bad. Get in, get in. Oh, at least you actually got to see what happens if Paula catches you in those uh in those moments, so I guess that's uh not everything's bad. Really, I can't can't destroy that. Alright, so I think we all know what's gonna be coming up here. I wanna make sure to get rid of these. sooner I get rid of these, the better it is going to be for taking out. Yep. Oh, you... Yes, you can. Oh, okay. Okay. And how did you... Oh, it's because... Oh, I know why. It's because you were right next to... Uh, right next to those things. Yep. Okay, I need to make sure. Get rid of you. There. Now, enough. <laughs> what? Okay. Where? Not sure where these other guys are. You just. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Don't want to step there. Okay. Getting a little bit hectic here trying to deal with really small enemies and these other guys. Where are they? Oh, okay. Oh, right when I pop out too. That's tricky. That's nice. Good job there. Can I tell you now? Thank you. Alright, so now let me set it to tequila. So every time I heal now. Oh, that's weird. It won't break unless there's an item in it. Well, I'd like with light shot, of course, what I mean. And now I can get rid of you. Whoa. Alright, good. It, I, I do find funny too that it took me took me until this like whatever a couple parts ago to realize that you can destroy boxes and stuff without actually wasting your ammo. Ooh. Okay, yeah, this this part. 
So I need to now unlock that by getting rid of this uh, cord, as you will. The only way to do that is to destroy these. Where does that one go? That one does not go the way I thought it was going to. Nope. Ah. Oh, <laughs> just right next door. This one's probably... Yep, over here. Okay, back up for a minute. Let's wait until... You guys are probably going to follow me, aren't they? Oh, no, they're not. Good. Red gem. Always nice. Okay, let me get the Skull Blaster ready. As long as it goes anywhere, I think. Yep. Okay, then this one is over here. Whoa. Okay, we got last one. Yep. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Now that I'm built record or whatever it's supposed to be, now we can get that goat head. Whew. Okay, so we're next this way. Oh yes, yes, this is kind of an interesting part. Okay, so we got another one of them. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to avoid you for the moment. Get rid of that uh, new enemy, which I believe this is actually the only level that those guys ever show up. I'm pretty sure, actually. Okay, close, close that back down. C close. Thank you. Okay, so turn it old darkness. I want you to. Oh no, the glitch sort of happened again. Notice that I'm invisible, except for Johnson. This has happened to me before. I'm getting attacked by this thing while the cutscene is going on. Yeah, because that's not fair at all, is it? <laughs> uh, I was actually hoping that that would happen again. Because, um, yeah, I, I thought it was completely unfair that uh, the way it happened um, on my whatever practice file uh, for for this LP I, I was really hoping it would happen him and then once again I'm thankful that it did okay give her a view so there we go and yes that that is ridiculously cheap I do have to admit Okay, so you need a strawberry. Hmm. Okay, Christopher, I'm going to leave you for a second. I'm just going to hold up, wait for the game to save. Hi, Paula! <laughs> uh, uh, I wasn't ready. I'm not ready. Oh, no, I have to do it. I have to do it now. Oh, no. Oh no! Okay. Well, that's a very awkward camera angle. Huh. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Pretty much every time I play this game, it's always that part that kills me, because you have Paula running after you. She kills you in one hit. You have a very small core. Oh God! I pressed L2 again. I'm an idiot. Okay, do, grab the strawberry, and made a break for it. Okay, once that closes, then we're good. 
Ugh. Can't believe I pressed L2 again. Again, it defaults to Absinthe every single time. Why is that? Well, I'll just might as well spend all the uh, white gems on red gems. Able to get four out of it. Nice. 20 to spare. So that means we should have five. To, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I have to do that part again. That's why. Okay, all right, that's fine. So, we want to upgrade. Um, I'm thinking capacity for both dentist and skull blaster. And then we can basically work on pretty much anything else. Um, light shot, I don't really, I don't need. Um, I guess we'll just work on the reload speed for the, for the time being. Again, now we're going to really need uh, too much. Alright, so now we can try this again. And you know what? This time, I'm not going to worry about... Uh, whoa. This time, I think I'm not going to worry about uh, trying to get the darkness to come. If I can actually, you know... Hit this guy. My... Oh, oh, no. And I can't even light shock you. Okay, you know what? That was a bad idea. And I'm just going to go ahead and activate it. Wait, do I even need to? Or can I just completely avoid him in general? Yeah, you know what? I can just completely avoid him. I don't need to do that. Because there's the brain. And, uh, well, he's... Oh, no, maybe I do. Oh, okay. Okay, looks like I do need to do that. Well, again, it'll be easier. It'll be easier taking him down with, uh... How little the enemies there will be. And it might only be attacked again. I can't really tell. Doesn't look like, doesn't look like I'm taking damage, which is good. Alright, that works for me. Because I got that on screen uh, once. I'm happy enough about that. Alright, you two. Boom, boom. Okay, so I have everything else. Yep, everything else is good. Uh, yeah, this way. So we need to give uh, this anything else over here? No? Nope, doesn't seem like it. So it should be, yeah, yeah, we're at the end of this. Good thing, too. Hmm. Yeah, I probably died a little bit, maybe a little bit too many times <laughs> during that level. But, alright, so we're now on to Act 5 2 different perspectives. I believe the beginning of this level is, or the, at least the first part of this is quite short, depending on how I uh, how I handle it. I could probably finish this in the in the next couple minutes. Sure, I can. Yep. Yeah, it is. Wait. Let me guess. I'm going to open this door again, and all the demons will be gone, right? <laughs> yep. Exactly what you said, Garcia. Yep. <laughs> it was a nice thought, G. Yeah, yeah, it was. <laughs> Alright, so the best thing is not that. Get away from me.
Okay, so the sooner I can get rid of these guys, the better. And I want to try and make sure I can get rid of these guys without destroying the uh, light uh, containers or whatever those, the light barrels. And it's not even for these guys yet. These guys, as we know, are very, are very easy. Yep. That was not okay, that was that wasn't good. Whoa. Are you? Come on. Whoa. Oh, that was bad timing. Whoa, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, giant wall hitbox. These are the guys that I was trying to uh save those barrels for. You know, the guys that kill you in one hit if they grapple onto you. Yeah, them. Because I want these guys to run after me. And that surprisingly didn't kill him. I was actually expecting it to. But it was a good thought. <laughs> okay, that's why. It takes two. Good. Good to know. That is... Not a good position where I want you to be. This is, the, and of course, this is the easiest way to get rid of them. Uh, quickest way saves up ammo and saves on uh, time and patience. But, uh, but more importantly, ammo. Okay, I think that's... Did I get the uh, white gems to the other guy? Uh, first guy dropped? I think so. Alright, now we can get back. Now we get into the... Uh, into the tower. All right, so now we're at the uh, second part of uh, Different Perspectives, and I think that'll probably be it for, yeah, that's going to be for this episode. Uh, so thank you everybody for watching. Next time we'll continue in uh, the Tower, is it, yeah, Tower of Hassle? Yeah, 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 I think that's what it is. Uh, so for Garcia Hotspur, we will see you all next time.